Matter of fact, who else I gonna pick? Hayes. Let me try Hayes, man. Come on. I'm about to try something. This might be a bad matchup. I'm about to try it, though. I'm disrespectful like that. This is going to turn out real good or real bad. Man, I'm taking chances, man. If I wanted to win, I, I know who I would have picked. This one for content. This is a pull-off victory. And now the time has come. All the talk. All right, boss, let's skip the these intros, man. Trying to put you to sleep, man. First round underway in this scheduled time. Ain't no time to waste. Teddy, obviously we have a matchup that the fans love, power puncher versus power puncher. But if you're one of the two trainers, what do you think? Well, I'm thinking about defense. If I can be a little bit better on defense, my power is not going away. I'm still going to be okay in that area. David Hay doesn't get a ton of credit as a defensive fighter, but that was some good defense with that block. Showing you some defense there with the block. Oh, they both land flush with uppercuts. To the belt line he goes with a left hand. He has his target. He lands the straight right. Back and forth exchange. Crashes home with the uppercut. Targeting each other, the exchange was something special. Fighting jab by Nichols. Able to dismiss it. Back and forth they go, each man getting the best of it. David Hayes left, landing well. That's a solid right hand by David Hayes. Dismisses his opponent's headshot. Move, move. Final 10 seconds of round number one. You Good see he comes job. over the top with that right hand, a real solid shot. Got some good work in. Got some good work in in that round. Here we go. Round two is underway. <clears throat> That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by David Hay. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Couldn't hit the elusive target with that straight right. Keep doing what you're doing. Fine work by David Hay. Blocks one, gives one. He needs to improve the accuracy a little bit. That was comical by David Hay. Listen, everybody likes to see a great knockout shot to the chin. But truth be told, at this stage of a fight, the foundation for winning comes by going downstairs. Just like the old timers would say, Joe, you kill the body, the head will follow. Halfway through round number two. Takes one, but gives one. Good work by David Hay. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Right there, but he also gave one solid effort by Kobe Nichols. Parries that punch intended for the head. Nice strike after catching one by Kobe Nichols. Trying to go downstairs, but off target. He comes with a straight right hand. Defense just covering up down low. Solid left hand to the head. <clears throat> I forgot he's so fast. Okay. He can counter a landed punch. 
Man. And round number three this is underway. Flush right hand to the head. And now he's targeting upstairs. Hard charging with that right hand. Gets rid of that effort. Good stuff by David Hay, working his combinations well. Well off the mark by David Hay. Good clean shot, returning fire. Well done by Kobe Nichols. Hey, you got some of that. Comes right back at him with a left hand. The fuck was that? Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Doing that lane back oh, shit, bro. Bring him. Punk ass here, bro. Relax, relax. Good block there by Nichols. Good work defensively by David Hay. Plus, he landed that counter punch. Yeah, and he forced him to punch. He made him, he drew it out of him. And then he timed them beautifully. Nichols' blocking ability is doing well for him there. Last 10 seconds of round number three. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. No doubt about it, you are losing this fight. Round number four underway, a chance to look at Teddy's scorecard. Do you see any way in which he can take his opponent's aggression and turn it against him? Yeah, the perfect way. I mean, boxing 101, <laughs> counterpunching. You got a guy coming at you, no better way than to change his mind. Make him miss, make him pay. Not able to land the headshot. Right to the head with that right. There's another left hand from him. Oh, that's good stuff. Fire it right back with one of his own. Good work by David Hay. Nichols is on the receiving end of a very good counter punch. Good looking two punch combo Keep by moving, David Hay. Keep moving. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. David Hayes at his best when the combinations are landing. He scored well there with that combo. Nichols is able to land a good, solid left hand. Good scoring shot. It was a straight right. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Nichols. Nichols' right hand scores well. I'm wondering what the opposing corner is going to do here. They got to their man earlier. They were able to rock him. And really, nothing's changed. He's showing them the same exact look, the same exact style that he came here with. Well, first of all, the opponent should keep doing what he's doing. You know, you're landing, you found something that's working. Stay with it until he changes. And the round comes to an end. Nichols has got to find a way to take what he just did in that last round and keep that kind of energy moving forward here because I do believe he's ahead on the scorecards in a close fight, very close fight. Yeah, I see it about the same way, but you just said it. It's very important that his corner people now don't really tell him that he's ahead. I think they let him think that if he's not behind, the dead even fight and keep pushing, keep pushing right there. Stay responsible, stay within yourself, but keep pushing. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by David Hay. A 
And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Nichols is doing a brilliant job with his head movement. He's displaying top-notch defense right here, and it's frustrating his opponent. It is frustrating his opponent. His opponent needs to make an adjustment of thinking right now and understand what's there, not what's not there. We know that the head's not there, but what's there? The body. He needs to start going downstairs. That will freeze up some of that head movement. Set up punch, one, two, two jabs to the body. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Side to side, move your head. Coming to the end of round number five, last 10 seconds. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Kobe Nichols. David Hayes so dangerous with that accuracy, a two-punch combination landing. Keeping his hands up, getting way of his opponent's effort. Oh, and he comes back with an uppercut there after getting hit. And now he's targeting upstairs. He falls victim to that big hook. Oh, he's hurt right there. He is hurt. You know, his opponent's doing a good job of just being patient now and looking for that one good shot. Well, you know, the landscape of this business, the history of this business is littered with guys that they've had someone hurt, they get a little careless, they get caught. He better watch out that he doesn't get put on that landscape. Nice block by Nichols. One, but gives one. Good work by Kobe Nichols. Moving enough. Move, move. Good combination to the body. He got hit right there, but he also gave one. Solid effort by David Hay. David Hayes' opponent is having a field day, Teddy. That left hand lands again. Well, he keeps moving the wrong direction. He needs to move away from that punch. David Hayes showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Final 10 seconds of the sixth round. Go around. This round comes to an end. I David can't put him down, dog. Give him that. Fight. I don't think there's any doubt about that. He's blocking the main. by a wide enough margin where he can't accomplish the task at hand. His corner's letting him know that. You can just tell. Good old fashioned one two by David Hay. Nice work. Bro, I ain't. I don't got enough time. He's going again. down, bro. All right, put your hands up, bro. You can see he's trying to score up top, but off the mark there. Very well done by both men to fire off those right hands. David Hayes not just loading up. He's landing combination punches like he did right there. Nice. Reich after catching one by David Hay. Gets rid of that. It was intended for his head. Nichols' favorite punch is the jab, and tonight, he's loving it. Well, the jab is the table setter, Joe, and he set a beautiful table tonight. 
Napkin on the left, you know, small fork on the left, knife on the right, and the food right in the middle. And he's eating all night. You taking some English etiquette classes? <laughs> you getting hungry? And now committing to that midsection as the target with the combination punching. Uh. He took a shot, but he came back with a right hand of his own. Another left. That worked out really well. Throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. And that's the end of round seven. This is it. You've got to make it a fight now. Nichols is leading on your scorecard as we start round number eight, Teddy. But there is some doubt here. Only a few rounds remain. Yeah, don't forget now in the other corner what's going on. We're just looking at one side here, Joe. But in the other corner, they're very aware of what's going on. They're behind. They're telling their guy, get after him. So it's not going to be enough to just stay status quo. This guy better be ready to lift up his concentration a little. like a fighter coming back with the right hand after getting scored upon Nichols is oh Teddy this has got to drive his trainer crazy because he's leaving himself wide open with these sweeping shots well you talk about that old saying leaving the barn door open and the horses are gonna go out well guess what the punches sooner or later they're gonna come in David Hay. That was not well targeted by Kobe Nichols. Here's one for you now, he says. Right back with the left hand. Last 10 seconds of the eighth round. End of the round is upon us. We have a fighter in front of us who just looks gassed. He looks tired. Now, Teddy, what can he do to overcome that when this fight starts back up? Well, first of all, this is where you're searching to those corners that you're not forced to search. Kind of like when you were a kid and your mother told you to clean your room and go into those little nooks and crannies where you never knew there was dirt. Now you got to start looking into nooks and crannies inside yourself. Places you didn't know were there before. You better find them. You better find them quick. David Hay. He's still not moving enough. Boo, boo. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. Stuff. Yeah, that's how you break up pressure. Guys coming at you, you know, trains coming at you. You don't go back on the track because it's going to hit you. You go off the track on the side, exactly what he did. And that train went right past him. He got hit. Keep moving. Keep moving. Good smooth work. 
work by David Hay. That's classic counterpunch. Yeah, what he did was he pulled that right shoulder back. You know, he just pulled it back, gave him the left shoulder, and then gave him the right hand. <laughs> Suck it up. These what boys gas. Oh. You never duck. You have to start doubling that jab, okay? Double that jab. That'll put us in a position. Round number 10, scheduled for 10. Oh, that's good stuff. Firing right back with one of his own. Good work by Kobe Nichols. Nichols is going to think about the next time he throws a punch because he just got hit by a good, solid counter. Punch! Punch! David Hayes, combination punching, working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Good defense upstairs to stay away from that offensive assault. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Kobe Nichols. This is not what I like with David Hayes. Sometimes he gets sloppy defensively. He needs to tighten up there. You can see how his opponent is able to get his consecutive shots. Decide to bring it. Page one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Look at that combination by David Hay. Comes right back at him with a left hand. He probably hey. stole it. So two guys who everybody thought had no chance of hearing the final bell now wait for the judge. He stole it. Uh, explosions early on, but later on, he stole it. Yeah.